co-hosting with me today on Twin Cities Live, and happy St. Patrick's Day. Yes. So what started as a one-night concert on public television has turned into a global sensation. The Irish group Celtic Woman has eight number one albums on Billboard's world music charts and a new DVD which just came out last week. And we have your chance to win tickets to their show tonight in a bit. But first, some of the performers are here today. They're going to get us to St. Patrick's Day with Spirit with Caledonia. And uh, this must be the new oh, CD called that. Emerald Music Green. I love it. And I, I was wondering, how did we pull it off to get Celtic Woman here on St. Patty's Day? I mean, they had to pay extra to do that. It's called, this is a high-budget operation, Joe. <laughs> how do you think we get you here? Hello, yeah, exactly. that's what I'm talking about. Well, let's welcome Celtic Woman. <laughs> Patrick's Day here on Twin Cities Live with a couple members of the Irish musical group, Celtic Woman. Maraid and Susan are here with us. Hi, ladies. Hi, so lovely to be here. Oh, my gosh, it's so nice to have you here. Okay, Joe was just asking during the break about your violin, <laughs> and now we have to know. I mean, this violin is so old. It's so yes. old. Okay, tell us about this. It is indeed. It's, it's uh, more than 300 years old, and um, it's uh, made by Matthew Salpin, and so it's, I'm a very, very lucky girl to have it. I really am. Our crew yeah. said, would you like us to take the violin? And she was like, <laughs> no! 
<laughs> yeah, I, I figured that you carried on, on on the airplane. You guys are so good, and uh, and you're on a 75 city tour. What is that like? It's hectic. Yeah, we're literally somewhere different every day. So you do have to kind of remind yourself, where am I today, and check your your, your tour schedule. Yes. But yeah, it's busy, but great fun, and, and what a great way to see America, you know. We're so happy that you're here on St. Patrick's Day too. I mean, it's so it's mm -hmm. nice. So okay, you've got to tell us a little bit about the differences uh, of St. Patrick's Day American style versus Irish style. What's standing? Oh look, they're smiling. <laughs> What's standing out? I, I think I mean, they're more enthusiastic. Yes, <laughs> fantastic. I mean, well, we were in Chicago yesterday, and um, right. was, um, the the river was green. Yes, yes. and uh, so we haven't seen that. And um, I was just thinking we don't have to re remind ourselves what today is, St. Patrick's yeah. Day. Happy St. Patrick's Day to everybody. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you do such a great job of it over here, yeah, too. Yeah, I think you do we better, do. better really? than we do. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Although we do have a fantastic parade. We have a fantastic parade, um, yeah. You know, in, but in, our in, celebration kind of lasts one day. Yeah. Over here, it's like a week of St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's, that's, we like to overdo things here in America. <laughs> yeah. The effects no. of what St. Patrick's <laughs> Day is. For us, every day is St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> Are you ever surprised? surprised at the magnitude of the fans because you've, you've become such a hit over here. Well, we're very, very lucky to have the best fans and friends, we call them, in the world, um, all over the world, especially here in the States and, and all over the world. And um, they're absolutely fantastic. The show has great support um, on the social media as well, and they come to all our concerts, and they even have come as far as Ireland to some of yeah. our DVDs as well. So we're very, very lucky. Well, I learned yesterday, Marie, that you are also the feature soloist in the Disney movie Tinkerbell. That's and when I saw no. the two of you for the first time, <laughs> I was like, these are real-life Disney princesses. <laughs> and then she really is the voice of almost a Disney princess. I mean, that, it, I, how fun is it to have that role? Well, that was absolutely a dream come true for me. Yeah. Tinkerbell and Tinkerbell and the Lost Treasure. Very, very lucky to be the feature soloist in those, um, in those scores. So um, I had the most fantastic time. Do any little girls ever come up to you and say, are you a real-life Disney princess? Does this <laughs> yes, they do. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> like Disney, both of you look like Disney princesses. I feel like you could be at the grocery store and Someone yeah. will ask you that question. <laughs> no. We no. don't look like this going to the grocery store. <laughs> <laughs> we normally in our job. <laughs> Susan, you joined the group after it started, and you are an original member. Was it hard to join in, or was it just such an honor to be yeah. part of it? I mean, it was scary because the girls had been together and so successful for like seven years. So I joined two years mm -hmm. ago. And um, yeah, it was because they'd had such success that you didn't want to kind of come in and you have to keep that momentum going and, and do a good job, make sure you don't sort of let anybody down. So yeah, but everyone was um, so wonderful and, and it, straight away we all just clicked oh. and had a great time. She's and absolutely been great amazing. Absolutely Stop. amazing. <laughs> you know, we're just so honoured to have the fabulous Susan McFadden. Well, we're so happy that you are here in our studio today. And this is the new DVD. It is so beautiful. Emerald Musical Gems just came out at the end of February. Mm -hmm. All the fan favorites, including Danny Boy, Amazing Grace, You Raise Me Up. And there's also a new live in concert DVD as well. If you ever need someone to sing McNamara's band, I'm there. Oh, yeah. there you go. Keep that it's good to know. I mean, if anybody had a scratchy throat or something, Joe would help you out. Ladies, thank you so much. It was thank really you. nice to meet you. Thank so, you. Celtic Woman is headlining a show tonight at 7 at the XL Energy Center in downtown St. Paul. How lucky are we to have them here on St. Really Patrick's great. Day? And there are tickets still available. Or. Be caller number five Yay. right now. You could win a pair. All right. Thanks, ladies. Thank Happy you so St. Patrick's much. Day. Thank you. Okay, well, I hear Emily is running into all sorts of Irish singers around St. <laughs> Paul today. It's oh. amazing how they come out of the woodwork on St.